Damn it, Eric, you hand that gun over. You were so it. sure that you held all the cards, weren't you? So sure that you could just force me not to file for divorce while well, think again, Adam Chandler. Drunk driving in Atlanta, remember? You see you? I don't think so. Get up. Whose is this? That's mine. I don't know. 80 and 55. You ain't never gonna get away with it. Oh, ye of little faith. <laughs> <laughs> Did you fix that transmitter? Ready to rock, boss. What's going on? <laughs> Turn me on. <laughs> Just a country boy. <laughs> <laughs> we'll cover that. No, no, Yo, Roger, no, frequency no, six. No, Check no, your no, local no, listing. We got a call rating, $10 and Who's in? Who's I'm in? with my boss. I'm been with Lucille. Daddy, see with Lucille? I say he can't do it. He can't do it. Who's your loyalty? Right. Over. Over for the boss. Ooh, child, he looks nasty. Oh, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be real good. <laughs> What's the cold meeting? Oh, is this beautiful country or what? How fast was I going? 80 and a 55. Wow, really? License and registrations. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's uh, see what we got here, Lowell. Let's see. Playing card. My only royal flush, signed by Shorty Casewell. And let's see. We got... Uh... License and registration, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Relax, Lowell, where's the fire? I'm gonna ask you one more time, sir. Do you or do you not have the documents? Of course I do. You know, I got, I'm a, I'm a law-abiding citizen, just like yourself. Difference is, I know there's more to life than my nine to five. If you knew that, you'd still have a wife and daughter to go home to. Sir? Put your hands on the bus, feet apart. Ooh. A little cranky, aren't we? What's he doing? Oh, I'm going too far, as usual. Big surprise. Whoa! Gee, Lowell, you could at least bought me dinner first. We're gonna take a walk over to the car, sir. This way. He's going to jail. He's not going to jail. He stopped writing, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> Enough about me, Lowell. Because it's not really me you're mad at. You're mad at yourself. Because you lost the one person who really loved you. You have the right to remain silent. You can see of names. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of religion. And I'm not talking about your ex-wife. Go, go. You know who I'm talking about, Lowell. Come on. I'm talking about... Kathy. Kathy. The guy has balls the size of cantaloupes. You think I don't know how it is? Risking your life for minimum wage? Never enough for those pretty dresses or that uh, fancy summer camp all her friends went to? Then some rich asshole takes not only your wife, but your own little girl. Have you seen her? Can't say that I have, Lowell, but I know people. And I know she misses the way you protected her. Made her feel like a princess. Well, you smiled at her the night of the prom. Good times you had teaching her the violin. The what? <laughs> the violin. Claire Delune. We played that together. No rich stepdaddy can give her that, Lowell. She hasn't called in over a year. Because you made her choose between you and her mother. Brother, you drove her away. Maybe I'll call her tonight. Tonight. When I get a phone right there on that bus. You wouldn't mind. My brother Lowell, what are friends for? 
Go up on a weekend and see her. Thank you, Brother Lowell. I can't thank you enough, and thanks for these. Praise the Lord. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. she wins? She wins. And he made a donation. Unbelievable. OK, I got the Wellesley decal thing. I got the wedding band, but a cop who plays violin, what was that? Red mark on the jaw from the chin rest. You know me, Janie? I know people. Whew. Yeah, well, I'll make it back. The sales are winner. Just when you least expect it. I always expected, Janie. That's why I always win. All I know, if it wasn't for you, I'd be playing doctor with some car thief. What can I say, man? Just say, thank you, Jesus! Son.